everyone, it's Elaine, and yep, I'm at it again. I have done another hinge journal. I'll have to admit, I think I'm addicted. Marissa is such a good artist and digital designer, and I'm on her design team. Now, granted, I'm not as fancy as some of the people on her design team. You need to check them out. Do a search for Sweet Pea Curiosities, and you'll see what I'm talking about. Anyhow, let's get started. This is my design team project for October. And if you remember in my last video, I did the Halloween um, journal, and this one is called Butterflies. It's a fall folder kit, again, at Sweet Pea Curiosities. And I will link down below where to find this kit and how to find Sweet Pea Curiosities on Etsy. And remember, they do a lot on Instagram, so that's important. Now, I'm going to say one more time in case some of you did not see my last video. I do my journals a little different. Marissa suggests that you use, I think she called it a photo stock paper. I don't. I use what I have. I have a ton of this certain paper that I got at the ReStore from Habitat, and I use that paper. It's a little heavier, but still not quite heavy enough to be um, printed on two sides. So I do one side, add a piece of cardstock, and then glue paper to the other side. That's how I do it. Um, also, in the last video, I showed you where I had used this tape for my hinges. Now, up, oh, repositionable. The last journal did pretty good after it stayed shut for a while. But in this journal, I'm having a little situation with a couple of the tabs um, or the hinges. So I'm going to have to go back and find that particular one and just do a little dab of glue under it. I won't have to take apart the whole journal, but I just wanted to warn you in case it falls apart when I'm flipping through, which it very well could be, because remember, I show you the good, the bad, and the ugly. Uh, anyhow, this is my cover. And uh, again, the one thing that I want you to know is that I only use Sweet Pea Curiosity printables in here. Now, these actually did, um, I think some of, no, the I didn't. I'm going to take that back. I was thinking that I had used some um, Word um, digitals that she had done, but I think these actually did come with the kit. And there's all kinds of stuff. Here's the little tabs that came with it. I haven't used those. Um, lots of little words to put in places. Um, this is a two-sided little tag. I just, I just love her digitals. They are so unique. Some of them are bright. Some of them are grungy. You just don't know. And here, this is three pockets that I did. And all of these printables all came from that one kit. And she will, from time to time, do like a little surprise sale. You know, but even when the things are not on sale in her shop, Every, the digitals for everything you get is so reasonable. Before I became um, a member of her design team, I bought a bunch of digitals. As a matter of fact, I think this might have been one of the ones I had purchased on my own. I just love it. But go and check her out. She also has a YouTube channel where you can see a lot of it right up close. Now, she is one of the fancy ones. Now, she will embellish these pages, lace and buttons and tucks and pulls. I want to show her digitals. To me, that's what I'm here to do. And, yeah, that's her. She can fancy them up. And maybe I'll get brave enough down the road. But for right now, again, I just basically want to just show you the things that um, she has given in the kit. And and they're great. I've never seen so many butterflies. Butterflies, butterflies. And remember, too, you can print these out and you can put them in another journal somewhere. You don't have to do like I did and just make the whole journal out of the one kit. I'm doing that because I want to show off this particular kit. Uh, whoops, sorry, there's some more. 
Um, and then with my repositionable tape. Anyhow, that's the butterfly file folder kit. Um, remember, I try to do a video every Tuesday evening, Eastern Time. You can find me on Facebook. I have a page, a group, my own personal Facebook. And now I'm also on Facebook with my um, retreats that I teamed up with Lori Law. And we do them in Georgia. Um, we do four a year. And we're excited about them. And uh, we hope that, you know, maybe if you're in the neighborhood, you can come. And if you're not in the neighborhood, you can still join our group. We have done some fun videos, um, you know, little crafty tips, mainly at this point about coming to retreats and kind of what to expect. But who knows what's going to be down the road. Also, remember, I'm on Instagram, Twitter, and Pinterest. And I do have a small Etsy shop. I sell um, blueprints. And I'm going to tell you right up front, I had someone say it to me the other day, Shipping is ridiculous on the blueprints. Yes, it is. I totally agree. I can't do a thing about that, though. That's because they're 24 inches long. It considers it an oversized package, even though it probably doesn't even weigh three pounds. Um, I, I just can't do anything about it. But anyhow, um, I do have a couple other things in my Etsy shop, too. So come on by, check me out, and I appreciate it, and I will catch you going down the road. See you next time. Bye.